Now that you have it with the workers, I would like to make you the very impression. And for the poultry farm, you can call for the farm. In the higher level, you can show me. Dad, thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah. I should be thanking you. You see, I promised myself that I was going to make you the richest of my town before you could talk like And I'm happy when you don't do it. <laughs> and I'm grateful that me and you are doing it already. Thank you so much. It's <laughs> well. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. I'm proud of you. And I'm also in that time. I just wonder if I'm still part of this family. What is the meaning of that? Father constantly remind me that my father left nothing tangible for me. What do you mean by that? Why can't he make me a manager in one of his companies? Why? Oh, that? I see someone is trying to be productive. Very good. Okay, um, fine. I will talk to my father, alright? He is going to make you the manager of the poultry farm. How about that? Excuse you. Can you hear yourself speak? A university graduate like me, a manager in a poultry farm? Come on, honey. You don't need to work yourself for nothing. Alright? Okay, fine. And I can talk to my father. He could make me manager in any of the companies. How about that? You will have to talk to your father before he can give your wife a suitable job. Oh, come on. What is wrong with you, Lizzie? I mean, what do you need a job for? I pay you salary. I give you everything you need in this house. You don't need a job if you ask me. You know what? I am done talking about this. I thought you were mad. Well, why are you working yourself up for nothing? You don't need a job. Okay, fine, I'll talk to my father. Working hard at the office. Exactly. And for long life and prosperity, it is family. We keep moving from strength to strength. 
Yeah, here we go, Dad. <laughs> just see. Here we go, Dad. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And to the latest manager in town. Mm -hmm. That's a one. From the staircase. Is breakfast ready? Yes, Dad. Good morning. Mm -hmm. What is this? Pap. You should have asked me what I wanted. I don't like Pap. So? You mean the stress of waking up early to assist Anne in the kitchen is useless? No, I didn't say that. I said I don't like pap. Definitely, I don't want it for breakfast. You just know how to bring someone's day. Hannah. Sir? You know I don't like pap. Why did you prepare it? She insisted I prepare it, sir. I told her you do not like pap. She said I should prepare it anyway. I'll go to the kitchen and fry me some plantain. Yes, sir. Honey, I told you I cannot continue with this anymore. What happened? Is it not your father? That man can never be appreciated for once. He finds reason to complain in everything, just everything I do. I just asked, what happened? What is it with my father? He just rejected my breakfast. Simply because it's bad. Then, honey, you should give him what he wants. It's not as if we don't have enough food in this house. And you expect me to go back to the kitchen? Hell no. I'm not going back to the kitchen. And that is why we have Anna. I mean, that's why we pay her. Allow her to do her job. Listen, sweetheart. We are all going to eat the same breakfast. If he doesn't want to eat with us, he should go hungry. Yes. Oh, come on, Lisa. This is my father we are talking about. I don't care if he's your God. He should learn to eat whatever I serve him for breakfast. This is my house. My husband's house. My house. My rules. What are you doing in my kitchen? I'm fine for people. I'm not saying you want to eat. Who is it? You can drop that and get out. I said he's very hungry now. Drop it and get out! Do you want me to push you? Get out! Take care of yourself. Mm. Mm. 
Elizabeth drove you out of the kitchen. Why? Because I decided to put all this in this house. Elizabeth, do I have to remind you that I built this house? And I employed Anna to be my cook. And it's my kitchen. I decide what goes on in there. Anna. So? Go back to the kitchen and finish up. Elizabeth, why did you lock the kitchen? It is my kitchen. times do I need to tell you that my wife is not your cook? She's not your maid. If you need anything to eat, tell Anna that's why she's there. That's why she's paid. So, do you know that sometimes when I look at you, I see myself as a man who brought a honeycomb to stay with you. If you would excuse me, I had a terrible day. me as if I'm a little girl that needs guidance in everything. He even wants me to beg him for a job. Oh, please calm down, okay? Don't be upset. I spoke with Collins and he promised to say this. When it comes, I'm sure this goes on. All these things will stop. Thank you. So now, what do I have for you? Anything chill would be nice. Anything chill. That means you need scotch. Bye, man! I think I know why you invited me. And why haven't you done anything about it? Gradual process, right? Some... Collins, listen. If you want a happy home, then keep your father away from it. Send him to the village. Or you buy a house for him out the outskirts of the city. That's simple. Collins. I'm sure you know my father is in the village. That is where he should be. Closer to his ancestors. And because you built your house with your money. I didn't build where I live with my money. It wouldn't be easy sending him out of his own house. Don't you think? 
Collins, can I ask you a simple question? Go on. Do you love your wife? I hear the one asking this question. Of course you know I love my wife. Well, your actions are proving otherwise. Collins, give her a happy home. I mean, make that home comfortable for her. and he will be forced to go to the village. You have to do more, more. Jerry, you don't understand. My father is a very quiet man. He can't be easily upset. No matter how much you try. You see, Collins, I'll call your wife and I'll give her tips on how to deal with him. I swear down, this time, he will feel it in his bones. See, with that, you will be totally handicapped. You see why I always come to you? <laughs> you are too smart. <laughs> Thank you very much. You're welcome. I will still come back. Thank me. I'll be waiting. <laughs> I know they count. And you are back. When last did you clean this house? Yesterday, ma. Mm -mm. Today, ma. <laughs> uh, How uh, many times? Every day, ma. Every day. Mr. Driver. John. My name is John. Oh, shut up. Who cares what your stupid name is? You're just an ordinary driver. Common driver. How many times do you drive me? <laughs> he doesn't normally go out unless he's going to golf club. You are paid to do nothing. Anyway, I am going to pay you for this. So that you go elsewhere. Madam, Ma I am still You. I didn't ask you to go. I am going to give you one more place. If you continue your madness of siding with my father. Thank you, Ma. Henceforth, your duty is as Yes, Ma. Thank you, Ma.
I told this one that I'll be going to Kaduna this morning for Jimmy Jimmy is not around, sir. Where did they go to? Auntie Elizabeth sacked him yesterday. Please yes. sir. How can Elizabeth sack my, my driver without my consent? Okay. Tell Eke to open the door. Eke is also not around, sir. She sacked him too? Yes, sir. With this lady. I can see you sacking my, my workers without my concept. What an insult. I won't give them a chance. Just to open the door. Just to open the door. Where is your wife? Go and tell her I want to see her. Your wife sacked my driver, my gateman, and my cleaner without even informing me. Did you hear yourself? Maybe your wife doesn't need the services of my driver and my hitman too. How can she sack people she didn't employ in the first place? Is that not the height of insult? She must have a reason for doing that. You are aware of it. very much, Anna. That is reassuring. Thank you once again. I'll get the water, sir. Please do. Thank you.
more in that? No, we don't. You're not. Oh yes, I'm right. Oh. <laughs> um, did you ask your wife what I told you last night to ask her? Don't tell me you woke up still having that grudge in your heart. Is that an answer to my question? But that honestly, I am beginning to have it up here. My wife is not your maid. She's not your cook. Excuse me. It's complaining. Yes, get me a glass of juice. Come. Make sure you wash your hands with soap and water before bringing the juice. Uh, Elizabeth, come and help me with this. Old man, my name is Lizzie, not Elizabeth. By the way, help you with what? I'm not a doctor and I don't look like one. Or you just want to report me to your son again? It won't have to be a doctor to use this. I don't want to use it. Come and help me with this. Anna, get me first to my yes. Rush to the market. The money is on my bed. Rush to the market immediately. Anna, huh? go and help her back to my house. Get going! Fresh tomatoes! Fresh! Don't buy rubbish for me. Ma, can you be Eliza? Eliza, I beg you, don't leave me. Lizzie, Mama, Lizzie, let me change you. Lizzie, mm-hmm, you're bien. Mm-hmm. I want to hear you. You don't look happy. What happened? How can I be happy? Mama, you need to follow me to my house. You need to follow me to that house to show them that. Woman, I'm paying for Bella's. Let's see, let them let know that I have somebody. You still haven't told me what happened, Mama. I just want to be in charge of that house, I want to be in charge of the companies, the kitchen, everything. Mama, I want to be in charge of everything. <sighs> Don't worry. I will come and display a little drama for them. Trust me. I will tell them that you are the daughter of a lioness. Bien. Hey. I'm going to show you the electric. I'm going to show you the electric. Hey. Nemo. Uzuanato. Action woman. I know what you can do. <laughs> Don't worry yourself. Oh? Let me go and get you something to eat. Hey, hey, mama, mama, mama. Don't bother yourself, eh? I need to rush back to town. Mm? Mm -hmm. hey, my husband will come and pick you. Mm? 
Well, before then, I'm telling you, child. Can you not offer my? You want to? You know what? You want to? I'm not a lot of girl. She insults Chief to his face. Anytime she likes. And what does a son do about it? Hmm. That one. He has never put her in place. He does not call her to order. He just sits. Without saying a word. Hey! You see? In that case, you have to apply wisdom. Don't get involved in anything that concerns them. They are one family. Okay. Yes. Uh -uh. Who am I seeing? Hello, <laughs> <laughs> How are you? I'm fine. How are you? I work. It's fine. Hmm. Oh, I hear you made straight A's in your way. I need seven A's and two B's. Perfect. <laughs> I'm so proud of you. Thank you. Good. I choose that I want to buy my job. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm-hmm.
Mama, you've not seen anything yet. Wait till we go upstairs. <laughs> okay, ladies. I have to go. Honey, I have to take mom to her room. Huh? All right. Okay. My good evening. <laughs> All right, my love. I'm coming. <laughs> A good did not but I now. You've changed so much. Eh? 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 The person is bent on What's the mama name of the book? Giving me a headache day and night. Who could that be? A maid or your husband's relative? Marapo, you just came. I have to freshen up. Eat. Well, delicious food. Now we're mates. Yeah. Eh? After that, we can talk. <laughs> that one is my way. Let me take it here. Must you be told I was coming? Eh? Do I need to take permission from you before I visit my son? No, no, my son, it's not like that. I mean, this is also your house. But what I mean is that if I knew you were coming, they told me, I would have arranged the, the catfish for you. I can't mm -hmm. remember telling you anything about catfish. Did I tell you I've never eaten catfish? My son, I will find you. Did I kill you? My only mama. I don't want to go to bed. I want to get it. This woman is in the gym. That's the other life. You see the money, I'm going to eat it for them. I'm going to eat it for them. I need to talk to you. Is that some kind of greeting? Do you eat greeting? Why do you always behave as if you're uncivilized? The cricket is a very good singer. But he sings in the box of the nature. Do you think I'm here to listen to your flimsy adage? Listen, I want a better and permanent room for my mother in this house. What happened to the guest room? She doesn't like it. I want to give her the room beside your own. Really? Mm -hmm. Really? Because you know that is impossible. That room belongs to my late wife. So? So the room should be left empty because it belongs to your late wife? <laughs> so I should be begging for you in my own daughter's house. 
ask him. Is that not sheer wickedness? Homer, need I remind you that this house belongs to you? Which house is yours? You're a wicked and greedy man. What did you say? You heard me. Shame on you. Your mates are in their villages and you're here discomforting this young couple. Can you imagine? If you want to do this here, your papa is around. If you want to go this side, he's around. Eh? You won't allow us young couples to experiment, do some things in this house. Go to the village, your mates have retired. I will be dodging him, we will not express our love in this house. Go and die or go to the village, come on, you <laughs> He hasn't seen anything. If we continue like this, we will not be standing He will pack his belongings and run away from this house. I'm not going to be Look at his face. Don't worry. <laughs> Collins, your wife brought her mother here to sorrow. She called me a wicked man. An occultic man. And you know that I'm not Eh? Yeah? Or what on earth would make you lock your wife's room for years? Did you hear that? Um, that's just asking question. What has gotten your brain off this capacity to think? Where is your sense of man? No, you are the one insulting yourself in front of me by failing to be a man. My son, please forgive me. If I may ask, Father, that room has been locked for many years, and I haven't even gone in there. And it makes me wonder is there anything going on there that I don't know of? Ask him. Ask him more. You see, if by tomorrow you don't hand me the key to that room, I will personally break it and replace it with a new one. And that's fine. Ah, wow, I love you, baby. And your mother's ghost will haunt you for the rest of your life. Hey, hey, Lupe, there's nothing like ghosts. <laughs> Mama, let's go. And there's nothing like ghosts. If there is anyone who is meant to fight for those things, it should be me. Because she was my mother. Now I know I have to write you.
What is in that bag? So all you do is make it look as if I'm wicked. You go about telling people that I don't cook in this house, right? Ma, where is this coming from? Were you the one who instructed that I must not be telling the kitchen? Mama, she's talking back at me. Anna, so you can now talk back at me. I'm sorry. You're not taking this rubbish into my house. Yeah, ma. What is happening here? Mm -hmm. Bring down the heaven if you can. Mama, let's go inside. Mm -hmm. Leave my way, old man. I called you here so that you would talk to your daughter. You want me to talk to my daughter? Yes. Have you talked to yourself? Or do you need me to remind you that you are the one that needs to be talked to? I've watched you since you arrived in this house. I noticed that you came fully prepared for that. Thank God you know that. Thank God you know that. Listen, I came here to rest. I don't have your time. I'm going. If you like, kill my daughter with your wickedness. Oh! <laughs> but I promise you, you will not like what you get. Mama, don't mind you. Hmm? Let me see you, Mr. Rudo. That's just a thing, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand. I said I want the books in the boys' quarters. Where? Where? I want to make use of it. I want to use that room as my store. But why the boys' quarters when we have two room stores in this main room? Why the boys' quarter where I store my books? And you expect me to answer that question? By the way, why do I always have to explain myself anytime I want to do anything in this house? My husband's house! Do you know you are? You are mannerless and it's not good. What is going on? Your father has refused to clear the books from the boys' quarters so I could store those things I told you that I want to buy. Honey, oh, please. Can we leave this family away? Just, just let him be, please. Goddess, tell your wife. But make her understand that I am not happy. Neither am I happy. Sincerely, I don't, I don't, I don't like this. All these coffers and stuff. I don't, I don't like it. Why can't we live in peace in this house? Eh? Every time quarreling. If this continues, I don't mind to build a house for you elsewhere. No, I will be the one to build the house for you. What do you have? Just quarreling with my wife. I'm 
I'm not in the mood. I'm not in the mood. I'm not in the mood. I'm angry with you, right? I'm not doing that I'm angry with you. Do you question your father to stop nagging at me, to give me my respect in this house as your wife? Caution him. Come on, my love. No one is disrespecting you in this house. And you should respect my father as well. But okay. Is that why you want to deny me my conjugal right? What conjugal right? Man, this is not there. I'm not there. Father starts giving me the respect that I deserve in this house. I won't get in between my eyes. Kiss me. My lord, you are doing the video of everything you want in this house. Even when they are against my father's wish. What else do you want? Make him to respect me. I deserve to be respected. Mm. Okay, fine. I, I will tell him to respect you. Alright? So is that okay now? Respect me. I'm saying I'm not in the mood. I'm not in the mood. Let them start respecting me first. Then you can come back. I will tell them. Yeah, they will respect you. Let them start. Then you can come. I'm not in the mood. I want you to sleep. I never promise respect to rush you. I will let them know. Respect to rush you, man. Okay. I'll rush you to. I'll rush you to with several blows that give me. His wife had asked me to remove your clothes from the washing machine and I refused. So? Take your bag inside. Let me see who's going to stop. Take your bag inside right now. I have sacked her for insulting my wife. Anna. So? Go and give your bag. Let me see who's going to stop. 
in that video while I said she insulted my wife and almost fought her. Listen. Listen to me, young man. Let me tell you, being a man is left. Not being this little is left by honest. Do you hear that? Honey, how do we relate? Dad, can that wait till tomorrow? No. Uh, it won't be possible because I'm taking my wife to the salon. Who was there at the hospital? Oh, Dad. You sound as if you're not living in this house with us. I always take my wife to the salon every Saturday. That's our normal ritual. I won't change today. I'm aware that she has a car. she can drive. Dad. Hi. Sweet, I'm ready. <laughs> ready. Yes, I'm ready. Let's go. <laughs> How are you feeling? Um, as always. prepare something for Chief to eat. Answer my question first. Did you enter my kitchen? Are you stupid? Have you gone nuts? How many times have I told you not to enter my kitchen without my consent? Come. Elizabeth, how long will you do this before you know that you are a your You don't have the right to hit my wife. And you I don't have the right to hit her. I will hit her again if I so desire. Take this food back to my kitchen. This minute. Your job. No, no, but he's a potential. I can get out of my sight. Sir! 
So, Auntie. Thank God for today. We've done what we can. <laughs> so, my love, if you know what is good for me right now, give me food. I'm hungry. You know what, baby boy? I'm taking it out. Out? Yes. Baby, I don't want to eat outside. I don't want snacks. I want good food prepared by my lovely wife. Baby, I'm taking you to the best restaurant in town. Okay, so let's go stay so fresh. Is it anyone's birthday? Meaning I can't take my handsome, hard-working husband out. Mm. Let's go upstairs so you freshen up. Let me okay. change to something casual. I'll give you a change. your problem. Please, please, I'm upstairs. So I can rock your world. <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go. Sasha, let's go. 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 let us go 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 let us go
hope you enjoyed your night. That's very well. And may you be sad. Do you want me to get you anything? For my day already with your constant complaints. Uh, baby, let me see it at the door, okay? Excuse me. Your hot water bath is ready, sir. Oh, thank you. Do you want me to help you to your room, sir? No man, I don't want I will manage. Thank you, sir. And it's too bad. Your father's hatred will not come to close to me. I will keep fighting. I will fight, fight, and fight until he gets there. I'll finally have his rest in the grave. I cost you. I cost you this ill mother girl. You shall cry and nobody shall be there to pursue me. You walk under the rain in a lonely road that has no end. Buddy, can you hear him? Can you hear your father? He just laid a curse on me. Yes. And he do something. You know what? Back to send that. I send it back to you. One million pounds. You are the one that weep, cry blood under the rain. Now I know what you wish for. To worry. I know what to do. Thank you very much. And bitch, man. But you said that. And bitch, man. But you said that. You see, 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 you you see, you see, you see, you see, you you see, you see, you see, you you see, you see, you see, you see, you see, you see, you 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 you
I will be away for a while. Yes, sir. Please avoid any trouble. If she wants you to stay away from the kitchen, please do so. Yes, sir. Safe trip, sir. Nothing. What? He did not tell me anything about you. Are you dead? Is something wrong with you? For the last time, what did Chief tell you about me? He did not say anything. He only told me that he was going to be away for a while. Ready to tell me what she asked you to do to me? Oh, shut up! Liars always swear with their lives. Where do your parents live? Ijaruma. Ijagen. Huh? That hell of a place. You're from a wretched family then? Yes, ma'am. And uh, I would like to see your parents. Huh? Are you deaf? Yes, ma'am. I'll take you to see them. You will go to church. Change to what? Did you come here with anything? My friend, go and wait for me outside. Are you still standing? Go! Go, 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 go and wait for me. To change as if you came here with anything. Is it not my husband's money you've been spending? Hello, Bugsy. I don't like this gun that you give to me. I don't like it. I've told you that I've started getting rid of everyone that makes me unhappy in my home. So I need a good gun, a better one. Right. I'll be waiting. Hello? Right. Are you getting rid of me? Are you scared? You don't need to be scared, Dad. I will only shoot you for the neck. It won't hurt. Okay. Please, Ma, don't kill me. If I die, my mother too will die. Shut up. Mm. 
this man. Let me just go. I promise I will not come back to this house again. Good. Because if I ever see you in that house again, I will blow your brains off. Yes, ma. In fact, let me come down here, ma. I will not go there again, ma. Shut up. Get in the house. Keep smiling. Start smiling. Smile. Do you want me to? <laughs> Is this your mother? Yes. Oh, my daughter. Hey, come here. Sit. Come and sit. Sit where? Inside where? <laughs> Sorry, I'm in a hurry. Anna, remember our agreement. Keep smiling. Any problem with them? She didn't tell me. Just like her master's daughter in law brought her back. And since she came back, she has not told me anything apart from that crying she's crying there. Is her Oga aware of it? Mm. She said the Oga traveled. She has not said anything apart from crying. What we have to do now is to call the Oga on phone and tell him everything. Let us just call him and tell him what happened. Hey, how can he kill us then now? How will we manage before he's called on the phone? Oh my job. Oh. Hey. How could, how could you do for the Carlos to Hey, your son brought that Jezebel of a woman as a wife to torment you in your own house. We call you the lion. But what happened to the lion in you? Hmm? You see, what I need to follow this channel now is wisdom. That's all I need. Oh. By the way, is that the reason why you invited this village? Is that not enough to invite you? Or even call our kinsmen? Is it not enough? Eh? Did you expect me to, to, to sit down, fold my arms? Eh? And let them kill you first. Nobody's killing anyone. Um, I'm, I'm in charge of the situation. Moreover, Collins and uh, Elizabeth are uh, children. Young people. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Don't tell me that. Bah, mama, don't tell me that. Don't tell me that. Eh? I don't want to hear that Collins and Eliza, that wicked, that wicked girl, eh? that they are young. If Collins is young, with his brain still too, 
Why didn't he do something when that wicked Eliza locked you up, the owner of the house, in your own kitchen overnight? You had a bad about Are you surprised? I hear everything. I hear everything. Now listen, I know what to do. I am going to call the meeting of all our own and tell them that Collins wants to kill you for us. It has, it has gone beyond that too. They have crossed the line as far as I'm concerned. Do you have coconut? Now you see, now you are trying to sweep everything under the carpet. You are changing the subject. You, coconut, coconut. I will get you coconut. Uh, I'm on my way out. But let me go inside and see if I can get coconut for you. But I will still come and talk about this. And uh, my wife too. Coconut and power wine. Coconut and power wine. Coconut and power wine. I will get down for you. You don't have to be sad. Don't worry about it. I will search for another job. This girl told you became an obstacle to your blessings. Eh? She promised to settle you. But the skin is like a lock and scattered everything. Oh, you foolish hand. Is this not Annabelle? My daughter? Mm -hmm. Ah, Maka. Uh, when did you come back? <coughs> uh, Papa, she just lost her job. Uh, she lost her job. Uh, and so? She lost her job. Okay. Open the door. That one is no. Uh, this one here is open. Hey! Look at this. Maybe she down. Papa will never change. I do not wish to talk about college and his wife. You don't want to talk about this. Nana, is it true that uh, Eliza, that wicked girl, locked you up in the kitchen for a whole night? Tell me, is it true? Is, is it possible for us to talk about the land issue that brought you to the village? You want to talk about the land? Yes. You expect me to, to fold my arms, watch them kill you? And now, the land issue. Hmm? Have you been able to get a suitable site for the project I told you about? I got one. Mm. Okay. Mm. It is your name. It belongs to Mr. Gilbert, the teacher. Oh, that's fair enough. Can we go and see it right away? What? Is Fugo? Collins? Oh, this is Collins. That man hates me with passion. In fact, he wants me dead. Nothing I do to make him happy pleases him at all. If I cook for him, he will complain. If I allow the cook cook for him, he will still complain. Mama, the man is heartless. Why didn't you tell me about his wife? Eh? I should have come to that house and make his life unbearable for me. Listen, trust me. Don't worry. I know what to do. I know what you can do. I will come and turn that house upside down. What does the name give? I will teach him a lesson, of course. He will know that my only daughter is not what he can use to exhibit his wickedness. Mm -hmm. Mbano. I know. You are my backbone. And I know what you express. can Mbano. What you can do. Let's go inside. I trust you. I trust you. My friend, I got back. Yeah. I'm right on time. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Where are you going carrying your bag? I'm going with you to the city. I want to go to that your house and caution those children. Biko, let me put my bag inside your car. Obi, I am not going to the city right now. I am going to Abuja first of all. Yeah. Abuja. I knew it. I knew you would not allow me to follow you. I knew it. Mama. Oh, Obi, you see, what is going to happen? Next week, I will send my driver to come to bring you. Yes. You understand? Yes. 
Let's see. I don't believe you. What do you want me to send him right in there? Next week. I'll wait. Next week. Mana, I'll go. If I don't see your driver next week, be rest assured, you will find me in your house. I will find my way to your house. Have I lied to you before? I've not lied to you before. So trust me. I, I actually, I ought to have given you some money for your company. Don't worry, don't worry. Eh? So next week. Eh, next week. Don't worry, my driver will come. Bye bye. We're not here. Who is here? Okay. Yes, what is it? What do you mean by what is it? Ah. Is that a new form of greeting? Did you see me here when we came to marry your daughter? Did you write your name on your forehead? Eh? Or have you come to torment me the same way your brother torments my daughter? Ah, ah, ah. Oh, oh. Now I know where the scorpion got its poisonous pincer. Name, warn your daughter. Warn her. Tell her to behave. Otherwise, I will tell her that I am Obi. Tell her that I, Obi Kwelu, will not allow any man or woman, in fact, nobody born of a woman, will dip his or her finger in our hot pot of soup without being lashed. Mercilessly. I say so. I, I can see that wickedness runs in your family. Uh, now listen, let me tell you. My daughter cannot be lashed mercilessly. Instead, she will lash you and the entire family mercilessly. Okay. Bam. You want war? That's not war. <laughs> you will get war. And before I start the war with you, I will let the whole community know that I, Obikoli, has brought war here. No way! Get out of hey, everybody come! I have brought war! Get I will out. show you that you have seen war and you cannot survive Get by war! Get out of my house! Odima, we shall see! This is the first sister! I have said the war here! Out. You will see war! You will hear from me! What's wrong with We shall see! Look what? Is he not that lanky man that calls himself B? Your father-in-law's brother. Uh -huh. What does he want here? He came to tell me to warn you to stop treating his brother badly. He even threatens to lash you mercilessly. Uh -huh. Lash me, Abu Lizzy. Mercilessly. Is he mad? Ha! Mami meze kobroi. He should have called me to come and give him the embarrassment of his life. I will turn the call off on our way house. <laughs> Calm down. Now I know that they don't mean well for you. But I will teach them a lesson. Mama, trust me. I can't wait to go back with you to the house. <laughs> hmm? I can't wait to go back with you. Calm down. Look at Obi. Coming here to warn us. Ah. To warn me. Oh, come on, Amma. Take up my Dibia. My Dibia, I'm not going to go. But in Takacho, no rage. Forget them. Forget them. Okay. I'm coming to our. I'm fine. I'm going to your house. Oh, there's no problem. Um, there's something I want to discuss about. Can't you see I'm going? So that thing can be. 
it is something very, very important. Yes. More important. I should come back in the day. Mama Eliza! Are you walking out on me? Mama Eliza! So, we'll be getting to Again. I said I want you to call Eliza to order. Why will I call my daughter to order? Huh? You will, you will reason. Why? You will reason. Yes. But then go and tell Obi to get more bitter. Obi to get more bitter. More wakulie. I will not call my daughter to order. Tell him that he is the one that need to call his brother to order. Mama Eliza, is this what you can say? Mazin Dunwe, huh? that is all I have to say. All you have to say? Hey, Canada, I know that's all I have to say. Canada, you know what to do. Hey! You know what to do. Eh? Uh, okay, let me take my leave. What are they going to do? You got it, but I'm Hey! Who is killing who? Chief, you don't tell me. Nobody is killing anybody. Now tell me where is that? Chief, she, she's here. Chief, I don't want to lose my daughter. It's better we live in this poverty. It's okay. People. You are not poor. Where is that? Anna, come here. Now, why don't you call me on the phone and tell me what happened? I don't want to die. You are not going to die. Eh? Now, get into the car. I really promise that I will not come back to you. I don't want to die. So. Just, just get into the car. Chief. Stay out of this. Thank you, sir. I'm not getting to the camera. Let me get my box. Is 
that not enough reason to call you? That you and your wife, you will maltreat my own brother in his house. And you say that is not enough reason to invite you. Call it you. To be honest, uh, if I had known this is the reason you invited me here, mm. I won't grant this invitation. Let me remind you, I'm a man. Alright? Stay off my business. Do not call my phone again to tell me this rubbish. Let this be the last time you do it. Collins. Excuse me. Collins. Collins. <laughs> Don't worry. Very soon we shall know who is who. Look at, look at, look at man. Man. Hey, I don't blame you. Why you leave because of my daughter? Why won't you allow her to enjoy her marriage? This woman, I can see that the suspect runs in your family. Madness also runs in your family. Now we'll get out of my room. Get out! Eh? It's in our family. It's your right. family that madness runs in. Mm -hmm. So don't get out of here. You think your evil charms or whatever you believe can get me? Ah! Error. Okay. So, is it error? What is he doing? Is he calling his? Let him call. Let him call. Go by my house. We want a guy. Oh yeah, yeah. Did you? Please send me some of your armed men to my house. Yes, there's a mad woman here. I want you to arrest. Yes. Very good. Mama, Mama, let's go. It's not like we are afraid of the police, but let us go. <laughs> this, this is enough. What is enough? Let's let me tell you. This is just the beginning. I am not afraid of the police. If you like. Tell him to call back Ions. I won't give him up. Why? We are not having your people. Let's go. Use left, man. We are not afraid of the police, no. woman. I just want to go. No. Give my mother food. Give her food. Let her get to The police Nonsense. is coming. Don't no, they arrest you. Shame on you. Shame on you. Nonsense. Damn. Oh, 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 Look at mother and daughter, brood of vipers. Nonsense. You get mad. You get mad. this man. And now I'm to have this You lack it. Your men are in the village. Your men are in the village. You get mad. It will not work for you, Mama. Who is the bastard? I told you. I told you that I'm not cutting my hair. What's your name? I'm not cutting my hair. I'm not cutting my hair. I'm not Should I be? 
Father, I am not my mother. You have seen it. My father. What happened? You want to watch it? What happened? What really happened? He's been here. Please, for me. For me, please. I don't understand. My father called police for you, and they did this to you. Why? It's okay, you have me. It's okay, stop crying. Why is so okay? Just give me one minute. Father! So you had the girls to call police for my in-law and you allow them beat her up like a criminal. That I'm talking to you, why are you wicked?
I want you to run the pipe to create a hole here, like a gutter, and where the water can be passing through. So, get to work in here. What is going on here? Good morning, sir. Good morning. I asked, what is going on? Sorry. Listen, my friend. If I see any mark on this wall, I will get you arrested. Are you listening to this old man? Go with what you're doing. What, what, what are you trying to do? I don't want trouble. If you don't want trouble, so my friend, come back here. Come and do your job. Don't you want money? Am I not going to pay you? Look at this. Have you seen what you've cost? Have you seen it? You're just wicked. You're nothing but a wicked old grey haired man. That's what you are. Mm. <laughs> mm. Mm. Mad dog. Mad dog. Gold figure. Everything you do comes back to you. Mapara on a bianni basu. Let me call her. I made you fruit salad. Oh, okay. Yes, let's be inside. Elizabeth, you need to be inside all this while. Baby, fruit salad, let's go inside. No, no, let me go. I'll just find it. That, sir. This woman came from nowhere. She will go back to nowhere. Sir, no. Please, sir. Please, sir. Sir, give me the knife. Please, sir. Please. 
Jesus! No, sir! Sir? I am not stupid. Yeah, no, sir. Let me get this away, sir. you talking about? Listen, Anna, I don't want to see you anywhere close to my kitchen. And make sure you clean it. Um, sir, let me quickly see what I can put together, sir. I got you some fruits. Oh, Anna, thank you very much. It's nothing, sir. Let me quickly wash them and serve them. Uh, Anna, please sit down. <clears throat> you see, one day, this happiness that I share may turn sweeter or sour. I don't understand, sir. My son and his wife are up to something. When the time comes, I want you to realize that I appreciate all your services to you. Sir, please, do not ask me to leave. I'm perfectly fine, sir. I like working for you. It is fine. I mean, I don't have any problems. I have not said that. Okay, sir. We need to wash the fruits and serve it. the meaning of this. Why would you bring this into my living room? What happened to the diner? You're this man. Why do you always like messing everywhere up with filthy, filthy things? Elizabeth, I am sure you do not shout at your mother like this in that you my mother does not mess things up like a pig. You're calling me a pig, eh? You, you behave like one. Who said... Anna! Anna! Don't you call me and tell not your answer. I told you that before. Ma? Why did you serve me this in my living room? Are you still standing? Are you deaf? I said you take this out of my living room. Is it in it? Leave me! Anna! Anna, come here.
for the second time one week. Your wife has used my car without my consent. This morning I was to go for medical checkup. She just brushed me aside and drove away in my car. We have what did you say? Yes. I mean, you always complain about it. It's not supposed. I mean, she's more like your daughter. I have uh, complained of your wife's attitude towards me on countable times. But you have not been able to do anything about it. Because from countable times, you brought up unnecessary issues concerning her. Simply because you dislike her. And I really don't know why you dislike my wife. She's like your daughter. Why are you always complaining? Listen, Diana, I'm not tired. I am looking up very early tomorrow. I'm just tired of the time. My wife is my wife, Dad. She did this, she did that. Yes, yeah, come in. Oh, Anna. Monita. Mm -hmm. I came to find out what you'd like to have for breakfast. My son is still at home. Yes, sir. He's having breakfast. Please go and tell him that I want to see him. Okay, sir. Is everything okay, sir? Are you blind? Go and tell him that he is eating. I think he's ill, sir. He insists on seeing you. I said you should go and tell him that he's having his breakfast. Exactly, sir. She says he is having breakfast. Go and tell uh, Collins that I want him to take me to the hospital. Okay, sir. I'm older than you are. Do you realize that I am older than you? Sweetheart, are you watching her? Look at where she's talking to me. Do something. Um, get out of my sight. I have served your father for years. He has never laid his hands on me. Your wife slaps me and you say nothing. I said, get out of my sight. If you look at me that way, we'll pour you this hot cup of tea. Get out! Sweetie. 
Eat up. You'll be late for work. Eat, eat. Temperature is normal. How are you making it look like a serious thing? Take me to the hospital. Dad, I can't go to the hospital now. I'm, I'm late for work already. I will call Dr. Philip to come treat you here since your doctor is not in town. I will. I will call him. I'll call him. I'll call him later. Alright, let me rush out. Huh? Why am I not getting it? Chief, you'll be fine, sir. You've been saying this for the past uh, three days now. Chief, it's a gradual process. You'll be fine. Just take the medication, do I? He's trusted you, sir. I'll come back in the evening and see you. Hello, sir. Yes. Thank you. See you in the evening, sir. Collins, if I were you, I'll take him to work. Do you think that would be the best? Of course. I'm not sure we have such thing in this town. Nay, nay. We have a lot of things in this town. We have St. Bartholomew's Old People's Home. We have St. Paul's Old People's Home. And we have St. Barnabas Old People's Home. All in this town. Okay. Um, I'll take him to Take him. I will take him. Please give us rest of mind. And from there, I will take him. Well, I hope you do as you just said. Because if you do, Collins begs you. Your home will become sweet and your marriage will be good again for your beautiful wife. Think about it. That's it. Take me to the hospital. I don't think this is about the most worth it. Dad, why have you chosen to be a thorn in my flesh? Eh? When will you appreciate the fact that I and my wife are really taking care of you? Take me to a good hospital. That's all I ask for this. Okay, since you've decided to be ungrateful, I will take you to a place where you'll be grateful. They will also take care of you there and you appreciate it more since we are not taking care of you. Have you started lying? No, Chief. Now tell me, what do you want to tell me? So... So... I overheard your son and his wife saying they were going to take you to the old people's home. St. Bartholomew's precisely. I saw it coming. I'm not bothered about it. I just want to be healthy again. That's what I want to do.
Sweetie, bring the bag. We don't have all day. Open the boots. Hurry up. Why would you open the boots? So nice, but I can actually dance. Sure, thank you. Is this not Collins? You were right when you said he's going to be a great man. But I'm not here to take much of your time. <clears throat> you see, I brought my father here so. The nurses and the sisters can take very good care of him since he has become a nuisance to me and my wife. What? Where do I keep his bag? She found him. What is going on? Father, with all due respect, tell us where to keep his bag. We don't have What is going on? The dog once took his owner to the exact spot where he attended. So do I pay in check or in cash? Whichever way you want it. Great. I just asked if I should pay in check or in cash. What's funny? Whatever. You can pay in check. You can pay in cash. <laughs> <laughs> Father, can I have a word with you for a minute, please? Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. oh shut up, shut up. <laughs> Sorry to ask. Do you know my father before now? Chief Fedman? Who doesn't know Chief Fedman? Kaiman? He single handedly did. Our second orphanage, 10 years ago. Oh. He's a kind man. I thought as much because the way you both are uh, you know, laughing. 
I knew him must be friends for a long time. He became my friend forever when he took a bold step to save his soul. Take a look at this picture. Do you know this one? Of course, this is me. Good. This boy was abandoned by his mother. He was diagnosed with lung infection. Nobody came for his adoption. She fed man came, picked him up, and promised me he was going to make him a multimillionaire before he done started. So tell me, is he not a good man? you aside because I want you to be witness to what I have been telling now. Um, two of my companies now belong to this company. My house belongs to and I that is my will and that is the way I want it to be. Please, please, father, please help me talk to my father. Good day, son. Father, This car. This place will the garage and I'll move up. Open the door for them. 
Eket. Ma. John. Everybody go back to your duty. As normal. Of my back now. I'm, I'm thinking. I will, I will kill you. I will, I will kill you. Get out of here. Where do you want me to go to? Where do you want me to go? To? God punish you. God will punish you. Go to hell for all I care. I, 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 are you not because of all this? Hey, 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 don't shout at me. Don't you ever shout at me, you bastard. Don't shout at me again. Look at the bastard shouting at the legitimate daughter like me. Don't shout at me again. You just call me now. Are you not a bastard? Oh God, with big letter B, bastard. That's what you are. Get off! 
What's the matter? Talk to me. Collins, talk to me. We've got to the old people's home. Okay. And the Reverend Father told me, Lo and behold, I was adopted. I was adopted. Collins. I don't understand. What are you talking about? I was abandoned at the gates of the orphanage home. Everyone rejected me. I was sick until my father came for my rescue. After a few weeks, I am not his real son. if you listen to me. No, no. And you can't even pretend to see you're not one. Which home? Which home? He willed the home to the cook. I and the cook have the home now. I have no home. Which home am I going back to? Can you listen to me? Are you mad? No, I'm not. I know, I know you're you are hated up. Listen to me. You see, as long as you were officially adopted by that man, you remain his son. Please calm down. I'm so stupid now. Call it not doing yourself anything. Wow. Calm down. Calm down. Please calm down. Don't me be don't 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 even touch me.
Went into that godforsaken village. Get to the memory, take your right. You will see the palace is just after that Anglican church. Follow you. I don't know where you are coming from. I didn't say you are one, but oh my god, I don't know you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So much. I could have been frustrated if you didn't accept to help me. What? So what is your name? My name is Elizabeth. But probably I've been listening. In other words, you can call me Lucy. Yes. Very good. So do you mind if I have your mobile number? I lost my phone on my way back from service last week. Hold on a sec. You're a graduate? Yes, of course. <laughs> and what is a graduate doing in this village? Are you not supposed to be in the city? Well, I am waiting for the last time. Oh, come on, Lizzie. This is not a place to wait for God's time. I mean, you should be in the city looking for a job, don't you think? Uh, but then, this is not the place to, to be. I mean, you have to leave your comfort zone. I wish I could. How about your parents? Just my mother. Yeah. So, do you mind if I see your mother? <laughs> see my mother? What for? Why? I mean, just to see your mother. See your mother. Is anything wrong with that? Okay, all right. Let's go. My house is just around the corner. Okay, here we go. Let's go see Lisa's mother. That means to commend her. And also ask her about her. I'm still in this village. Mama! Hey! No! You're back! 
Shema. How are you, my son? I'm very fine, and you? I'm fine. Who is our husband? A friend from the university. I asked plenty questions. Let's go find this. Oh, go, 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 go. So, my eyes life with you. Fine, No. My son, what do we offer you? Oh. I have some oranges. Oh, come on, Mama, don't stress yourself. I actually stopped by to see you shopping. Okay, maybe next time. It's okay. Hey, no. Thank you. Hey. Excuse me. Oh, oh God, I can't go to <laughs> Welcome, good. Hey. How do you? Uh -huh. No, Paul is well. Yes, yeah, <laughs> well. Don't mind my mother. Okay, Mama, let me uh. run along. Like I said, I will come back next time. Uh. See? But for the meantime, just have this. Use it to buy anything. Mama. For me, for us. <laughs> Thank you very much. God bless you. Oh, you. God welcome. bless you. Bless you too. Bless you too. Yeah. All right, mama. Let me run along. Eh? Mm. Remember what I told you. That's it, you. So, Thank you. How are you doing? I'm fine. <laughs> Let me get this. Oh, no, don't worry. I actually got you this so I can always reach you whenever I want to come. Mama, Not just one, but big phone. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Mama, look at it. Big phone, no Android, though. You see, I have thought about what a graduate like you would do in this village. And honestly, it is not captivating to me. So I have secured a job for you in the city. Yes. And secondly, I secured a land where I will build for you and your mother. Hey! Hey! Mama, come. You see, come. Hey! Hey, come on. Hey! Allah Thank you. Me. God bless you. Happy I go to the moon now. Mama, land, job, and the city. Bless you too, Mama. Bless you too. Mama, God sent. Thank you. I don't know how to start. Thank you. 
I'll check of words. God bless you. Don't worry. God bless you and bless you again. Amen. Bless us all. Bless us all. Amen. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, Mama, I have to run along. I have a lot to catch up in the office. So I'll come next time. Thank you. Thank you. Bless you. Honestly, I don't know how best to thank you. It's okay. God bless us all. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. So get ready on Sunday. I'm coming to pick you up. Okay. Call you. Why yo? Why yo? Why yo? Why yo? Oh! Bring this, bring that, guys. <laughs> To be really in appreciation of me all the time. What I'm doing, I'm doing it for God. Thank you, anyway. So I told my father about you. About me? Yeah. <laughs> what about me? I told him I've seen a girl like. Is what I want. It's your want. I don't care where you come from. I don't care if you're the daughter of the president. It is my choice. Right? So, do not look down on yourself. <laughs> Waiting for my ring. <laughs> Thank you very much. You've made me the happiest woman on earth. And you made me the happiest man on earth. 
got you. I got you. Oh my, 
by your nobleman dub skull. Why can't you let me be? Haven't you done enough? Haven't you done enough? I'm not your young woman. Please, listen to me. Because you need to do something. Do something. Your real father might be richer than him. You can't go back to that. The only thing I have to do is to send you back to your miserable mother. To send you back to your miserable mother. Let me be, Elizabeth. Never like me. Never like me. Is it hard to say? Never like me! Do something. Behave like a man. Christ. Stop crying. Get up and do something. You must be the new gate man. Uh, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Where is my daughter? Your daughter. Your madam. Oh, well, me, I don't know. Uh, well, yes, 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 I don't know. Yes, mm -hmm. yes ma'am. Take this bag inside. Father, my own here. Not too close. I hope it's that's all. I don't think I anybody bad. Are you stupid? If my daughter hears what you just did now, she will fire you. In you In short, you are fired! Only there's a monkey banana. You're still here. Eh? Shameless man. Balance your knife before now, Juice. Another person. Oh, mama, mama, mama. Please. My head is spinning. Enough of this, your contractor talk. Thank you. 
As a matter of fact, I have nothing again. What are you talking about? Minister, you are here. Welcome. Thank you, Chief. Where is Collins and Anne? Uh, Anne. Anna. Collins, call Collins. Can someone tell me what? Collins, good that you're here. That is your good notice. You expected to leave this house in less than three hours. What did I hear you say?
Okay. Your food is ready, sir. Oh, okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Everything you do 
I wish I'd be given a second chance. In my next world, you will be my father. You are the man I've known all my life.
any way to go to. So I was wondering if I could stay here for some time just to figure out what to do. Correct. You should have told me on time. You don't just wake up and come and stay in my house. It's me, oh. Collins, your friend. Collins, I know. Collins, I know it's you. But you see, my wife and her sister came in last night. And as I talked to you, we're expecting my mother-in-law tomorrow. Come on. With all these, how can I accommodate you? I am stranded. I don't have anywhere to go to. I don't even have money on me. You and I know you have plenty rooms in this house. Why can't you just allow me to stay in one until I figure out what to do? Are you actually saying this to me? Collins, you're making me look like a bad person. Come on. My hands are tied. It's not as if I don't want to help. I was busy inside, Collins. I wish I had something I could, I could, I could offer you. Yes. Well, I just hope you're not going to put too much money on that car. However, bring it tomorrow and I'll see what I can do. No, 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 don't worry, keep the key. When you're coming tomorrow, you come with it, okay? Then you have to escape. On my forehead, Kaya. My, huh? please, I was my daughter is but a child. What do you want from me? What do you want here? My in law. Shut up, woman. I am not your in law. So go straight to the point or you get out of my house now. Please, okay, please calm down. I want you to help me bring your brother. I knew it. I knew that Collins was never happy. Our ancestors said no. They were never happy that we had to take that. That. Get out of my house. Please. You can still beg your Get brother. out of my house now before before I do something stupid to you. Get out of my house before. Yeah. I still want to get out of my yeah, house. Come down, please. Good morning, sir. I have not seen you give me like this. <laughs> Nay, I'm going to your house. I hope all is well. 
on this way, my husband. I I just want to talk with you. As you can see I'm going for it. I know. But honestly, I need to talk with you. Biko. Am I saying anything? I I come to I actually come to beg you. Beg me what? I actually came to beg you to help me talk to our in-laws concerning Elizabeth. Which in-law? Our in-law, Elizabeth's husband. Is this why you stop me from going to meet him? Ah! From this area, my husband. My husband, you go. My husband. My husband. My husband. Let me ask you, when they came to marry Eliza, did you inform me? When I finally found out, what did I tell you? Oh yeah, yeah. Mama Eliza, are you inside? I'm right there. Uncle. Oh, how are you? How are you? Bye, bye. You're welcome. Uh, where is your mother? She went to get some. Oh. Let me get a seat for you. I'm going to church. Ah, she's here. Oh. Thank you. Oh. Oh. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Mama Eliza, you're back. Yeah. What's in the way? Oh? Yeah. I heard that somebody is coming to ask for your daughter's hands in marriage. Yes. And you didn't bother to tell us her father's brothers. But the normal thing is for you to tell us. You can't do it alone. And then me and me. Hey, you do it. Huh? If you don't know what you Ola! Mwa! Ola! In my brother's house. Let me tell you. It is very, very important for you to ask questions about the people that want to come and marry your daughter. Mama Eliza, it has not gotten into an insult. What I'm trying to do is what I'm supposed to do as the only surviving brother of a late husband. This element. Can you recall it? And now you want me to go and talk to people whom I don't know. I can't do that. I will not do that. I don't want My husband. Hey, don't husband me. I husband the boy. It's the part 
clear no wa ko My husband, please forgive me, Biko. Help me. Why are you Biko? Get up, get up. I will not get up until you forgive me. Oh, Biko. Okay, I'm forgiving you. Thank you, my husband. I will talk to you. Thank you, my husband. You can go home. I will talk to you. Thank you, my husband. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You want me to go and talk to you? Is it the bastard or the man who is on you? Well, my husband. What will people say about my daughter and I? Could we be this stupid to have lost this blessing? Mama, stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Shut up! You are too young. You too young. If you are dead, you can't go. This will not happen. Mama, you are going to run me for us. Are you not the one that put me into this mess? Eh? You see, who put you into this mess? It was your stupidity and stubbornness that caused all this. Mama, you raised me to be stubborn. Mm. You are stubborn, I am stubborn. We are stubborn people. Elisa, you are not just stupid, but useless. It will keep me. Eh? You are useless. Mama, if I'm useless, then you are stupid. In fact, you are a stupid mother. Eh? Mm. In a, in a... Look, what is it? Elisa. Elisa, you will die untimely. Devil will punish you. It will start from you. That devil will start from you. Devil will punish you first. My devil, my all his angels will punish you first, Mama. You're a bad mother, wicked mother. You, you capo. They will listen to you. Instead of you to use your number six, you know, need a lipstick, knife pencil. Was it only the number five you told me to use that landed us in this mess? Oburia. If I had used number six, by now I am a prison. Eliza, I'm looking at a challenge. I'm going to have to carry on your collar. Eliza, I know what to do. I'm going to. Mama, you take. Mama, when are you happy here? I'm giving you respect. Are you happy here? When are you happy here? Mama, Eliza, what are you doing? Are you doing? You touch me, oh, Eliza. Mama, you touch me, oh. You touch me, oh. Mama, are you happy here? Are you happy here, oh? Mama. Mama, I'm giving you respect, yo. Mama, I couldn't want more. Yes, oh, mm, yes, oh. Yes, oh. Mama, I'm not. Mama, I'm so new. Mama, I'm so new. 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 I know a man of Bodo. Eliza, I will not stand up from here unless you offer me a cow. Eh? I will say cow. I will go and buy 10 trailers of cow. If you don't want to, if you don't want to stand up, Dina never. Whenever I marry your bed, look at you. Eliza, woman. your generation will suffer. Yeah. You are suffering Eliza. already. <laughs> 
You are stopping already, Mama! Wicked woman! He said he didn't teach me how to respect my husband and my father in law. Behave like a good boy. You know, I'm never fucking again. Do this one. God will destroy you! He has destroyed you! God has destroyed you! God has destroyed you! You can destroy you, Mama! Name of what? You entered my kitchen. Obviously, Mama, I went to collect some food. <laughs> Come on! Drop it! No, go on Obviously, Mama, I went to collect some food. Which food? My food. Let me ask you. Did you come back to this house with a grain of rice? Or even a dime? You had to go to enter my kitchen. Now, in, in, in our one nuclear food. Hey, what? Oh, what? Hey, 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 what? In a wana, I don't understand you. You want to wash with my pocket? Eh? Which 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 pocket are we talking about? My own pocket. This is my pocket. Oh, you came back empty. Means you are an empty vessel. your uncle i don't know you you are not my blood you can never on earth be my blood never let me pass uncle, uncle please Hi. i know i've messed up I, I don't care i don't care whether you messed up you messed down you messed right left round about everywhere that is your cup of tea Look, don't 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 come uncle again no. don't come uncle i can't talk to the moment you open your mouth and call my brother, my brother, your father, he gets me mad. Look, listen, don't ever open your mouth and call him your, 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 your father again. Get out of my way. Get out. Don't, don't, don't come here. Don't come here, yo. Get everybody want me, bro. Please. 
I feel so ashamed of myself. I don't care. I feel like committing suicide. Please, please help me talk to my father. I don't mind to be, I don't mind to be a good man or to be a cook. But just to make up for the love he has shown me. Please. Point of correction, young man. Ferdinand, my brother, is not your father. Number one. Number two, if you want to commit suicide, you can go and kill yourself anywhere you like. Not in my company. Listen to me. You're not my blood. I don't know you. I can never be your uncle. Father, you're a bastard. We pick you up from nowhere. You come and you behave as if we told you to somebody and you, you treat me. You treat the benefactor any how you like because of a woman. A woman! Kufukogi! Because of a woman! Okay. Kufukogi, I find out. Who come on? Who come on? This is the only family I know. This is the only family I know. This is not your family. Go to your family outside there, not here. You don't belong to us. We don't know you. You are not our blood. Get out of my compound. I will die. I will die. In my compound. You don't want to hear. You don't want to leave. Or the man. Okay. Everything will not die. Okay. I have met you. I am coming. I am coming. I am coming. I'm a Get out of the house. What is it? What is it? Nonsense. Get out. Get out. No. Nonsense. You bastard. <laughs> You sent for me. Yes. Anna. What is this? Look, Anna, I am making you the managing director of my bottling company. Congratulations. Sir? Sir? Yes. Thank you very much, sir. Sir, you have done more than enough for me already. This is too much, sir. Look, Anna, you deserve even more. In fact, there's a, a car attached to your house. Sir? So? Anna. So? Anna, please get up. No, sir. I... Sir, so, ah. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, sir. Look, Anna, just get up. You know you are a wonderful person. You deserve more than this. Just get up. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you, sir. My hands are shaking, sir. Stand up. No, no, don't shake. Oh, thank you so much, sir. Thank you, sir. Get up. 
this. Ah, oh, Nossa, let me thank you very well, Sam. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you so much, sir. Oh, okay, I have a job now. And the car. Thank you, sir. <laughs> thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Nossa, let me do it, sir. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much, sir. Everything you do, everything you do comes back to you. 